Let PL delays its plan to bill customers for Hurricane Irma costs. After saying in October it expected to collect an estimated $1.3 billion, FPNL has put the plan on hold. The Hill Tribune says FPL had been expected to file a petition last week with the Florida Public Service Commission and begin recouping the money from customers in March. But FPL spokesman Dave McDermott said Wednesday the company has not moved forward with the plan primarily because it's studying implications of a federal tax overhaul approved last month by Congress and signed by President Trump. McDermott said the utility anticipates it will have more information by the end of January. At least in the short term, that means customers will not see Irma-related storm charges hitting their bills in March.